Olivia here, and I'm still in Vegas, and it is now my third day sports hunting, so let's hope we find some good ones. I'm not really sure where we're going today. Maybe find Globe, maybe Target, we'll see. So I hope you guys are as interested as I am and see what we get. Make sure to subscribe so you guys can see the other videos I will post for the second part and the other parts that came before this one of the Vegas sports hunt. So yeah, let's get into it. Alright, so we're actually going to start off where we ended in the last part, so if you guys have yet to see the earlier parts, make sure to check them out. They will be linked at the end as well as in the comments, so let's get into it. Alright, next stop, Target, and let's hope they have the new 10-inch squad or they have the new clip squad. I can never find the clips at Target, but I've had good luck at this Target before, so hopefully we do today. Where is the sign? Why is it flat? <laughs> No way! They have the new 10 inch ink Easton and he's the last one. Yes, if you guys remember, I didn't get him at Fred Meyer. I'm going to leave him there. There's three of him left. There's only one left with the Axo, so I'm gonna get the Axo. I'm gonna get him and look it. I'm so happy they have a new squad at Target because it's been basically a whole year since they've updated the squish that they sell here. Look at that. She's so cute. Like, is she a Christmas one? Marsha? Early? You Christmas only at Target? I don't know why, but the peppermint really threw me off thinking she was Christmas related. So these are the two new ones I see. Other than that, they're all like the old ones, these lane ones. And more. Okay, I'm gonna grab Easton because obviously I wanted him and he's so cute. And he's a dream of mine of the new ones. They also have Valdette here as well. I already have her. So cool, I'm gonna get the Easton. I'm so excited. So far, no clips, but I found my dream Easton the anglerfish. I'm so excited, literally. They have the big octopuses. Oh, they have another Easton. They also have her, she's so cute. And they have a few more Easton's. I wonder, since he's the last one left, who was left in his squad. Because they have like so many Easton's, which means they had so many of his squads. Wish I could see the tag pick, but oh well. Also, they're all slightly different. As you can see, his spots are like that and his are like that. Now I have to decide which one I want. That one's cute. Spots on the forehead. I think I'm doing this one. I like the spots going across. Yay! I am looking for the clips. I have no idea where the clips would even be located. Would they be in the plush section? Would they be in this section? Like, I just really want one of the clips. Not even Bigfoot. I just want like the owl one or like anyone else. I obviously want Bigfoot from the clip squad, but like, if I can't find her, I would want at least someone else from our squad. Where are they? But at least I found Easton, so. Yeah, not even any clips here, sadly. Where are they? Checkout time. I also found a cute mushroom jar. Well, that was crazy good luck. I found Easton, who I wanted. Wow. But no clips, though, obviously. All right, second day, and I got Easton from Target. And then all of these cool, like, sticker notes and everything so super fun it was totally a great day today and yesterday at five Low, i have to say i got my dream i wanted from target which is crazy cool all right next is walgreens across from sabers and let's hope that they have like anything just buzz and the like five inch squad They do have the little axolotl though. They already have him. He's so cute though. But no dang clips or even blind bags. Next stop is Burlington. All right, all they have is this blue slaw from like the Valentine squad. Oh well, I, at least I checked. Oh, they have a pet bunny one, how cute. Next stop is Target. 
So I was surprisingly disappointed they didn't have any new ones, not even any clips or blind bags. I couldn't find anything. None of the new ones somehow. I don't know why they don't have any of the new ones. I think I at least have one new one, right? I have no idea where the clips would be, but I checked a bunch of places like the Pokemon cards, where they have the blind bags, and they have nothing. Okay guys, first stop on the second to last day of school shiny in Vegas is another Smiths, so let's go in. Yesterday was a bit unsuccessful, so hopefully today is a lot better and we can find some good ones. Okay, let's see what they have here. I see a big box. Let's see, probably nothing, but maybe they have some. Ooh, it looks like they have some of the Easter Squad. The squad I got in the first part when I went to Smith's. And they have the new Lexi like, Squad. Let's see who else they have hidden. This bunny is so sweet. I'm pretty sure, yeah, she's from Wendy's squad. What the heck? That's a really good price. Two of them for $20? What? Two of these guys for $20. Wow. If I were to get two, I'd probably get her and her because I have nothing i don't know what she is but i don't have anything like her but i also want kai sparkly belly kai i don't know i just love her coloring so that's why i like her and her spots so i don't know honestly i might think about it and then come back and get them because it's a crazy good price okay so i'm gonna leave and then come back i'm just going next door to the gift shop with my grandma so I'm gonna decide if I want to get them and I can come back and get them because I have plenty of them I think I'll definitely get this one and the green and the green jellyfish but like I don't know it also says that they're like ten dollars each so I don't think I need to do the two for twenty deal but I do want both so <laughs> kind of have to do the two for twenty deal right it's a good deal that's like a crazy discount Nothing too crazy in the claw machine, just the pug squishmallow, and that's about it. Okay, you guys, so that was a really good stop to start the day because that's a really good deal. $10 when they were originally $25 each. I'm probably definitely going to get them, like for sure. But now I'm walking into the gift shop my grandma's at, and then I'll probably go back later. Okay, I'm walking back. I, I definitely am going to get both of them because they're really cheap. Like, it's such a good price. I can't resist it. Are you kidding? Like, I got the 8 inches at the last Smith's in the first hunt for $6 each on sale, and now they're gonna be the 12 inches or $10 on sale. Definitely gonna do it. Okay, so I'm back. I'm gonna get Bijon. I don't know how to say that. And then I'm also going to get For Forina. Because they're literally two for 20, $10 each with the Fred Myers card. Oh my gosh. So, I don't need them, but at $10 each. I have to get them, right? I have to. They're $10 each. And they're so cute. I don't have whatever she is. I don't have her. And the jellyfish. Mm. Let me know down below which one is your favorite. Checkout time. Oh my gosh. I cannot believe I keep finding all the good squish sales this trip. And okay, you guys, so it was originally $54.17 and I saved $30, so it was only $21.65. That is so cool. I am so excited for them. All right, next stop. Okay, so they always seem to have like Squishville sets here, so that's what I'm looking for. Oh, it's one of the fake ones. <laughs> it looks kind of funny. Oh look! They have the big ones of the Valentine Squad. Oh my god, massive sunny. That is so cute. They're only $14.99. That's a really good price. And then here's the koala. So cute. I've never seen him before actually. Oh, or the kitty. Or oh, Sunny. Sunny is actually... I missed the Joelle Squad sadly as you can see. But... They're all so cute. Oh no. Um, wouldn't it have been crazy if I found Joelle? Like, 
that would have been crazy but here's this version of sunny she's super cute she has a silver crown silver wings she's such a sweet baby i i don't need a big b but i kind of want her i don't think i'm gonna get her because i don't need her but let me know down below if you guys would get sunny So that's all that they have at this Ross, which I was surprised that they even had any, so that's pretty cool. Sadly, there is no pet toys. I would love to find like the pack of pet toys because they're super cute little like oranges, but sadly to no avail. I always look, but I never find. I never find them. Okay, next stop is our first Walmart in Vegas. Let's look for the new squads also. Oh my gosh, they have Malcolm in there. They have two Malcolms. How cute. Maybe I can try for Malcolm. He is so cute. Oh, they have big ones? What if they have big Squishmallows in there? That would be cool. Oh, and they have the Valentine's They have a lot of different squads in here. As you can see, Valentine's Day, the dog pet toy, Malcolm, the tech squad, and this guy. Finally, I found the toys. I've been walking around for like five minutes straight. Put down the milk. Oh my gosh, this one is super cute. I actually never saw like the full squad for this one, and there's no full squad, obviously. They have Isis back there, the old Fuzzmolo Karina, the skunk. So far, besides these guys and Donkey, I have not seen any of the new ones, except this guy. I haven't seen him yet. He's super cute. But these are the same ones that I have seen recently. So I am missing the Sydney mushroom, which I'm pretty sad about. This little lady, I'm pretty sure, is from the squad with Caden. And then Duke, I got recently. This catacorn, for some reason, has massive eyes, and it's kind of creepy. I found the Cameron pencil pouch and I already have it if you guys want to check out my Walmart stationery video. And then I aggressively look through the box for some reason. Just checking there's no blind bags or clips or anything and I don't see much. So sadly, I did not find um, Sydney mushroom. I really want the green mushroom. I want the um, Hot Topic one better because she has a little leaf on her belly. But if I obviously find the one at Walmart, like I'm gonna get her. I really want her so hopefully next time I check Walmart, they will have her because she's super cute and she's like a 10 inch and i think she's only 10 dollars so that's a really good price for a mushroom bruh it's not even squishmallows it's just some dang hula hoops that's funny okay so i can't ever seem to find the winston pencil case which is pretty upsetting but they have the lola one and the cameron pouch as well but nothing else really in this section in the other entrance, I checked out this claw machine and all they had was the fries and he's actually really cute. I kind of really want him, but mostly in a five inch. But yeah, that's me. All right, you guys. So here's the haul for the fourth. Oh my gosh, they're all shoved in the bag. Here's the haul for the fourth day. Just the two 12 inch sea guys from Smith's to add to my collection of what I've gotten already so far. All right, next stop and our last stop is this gift shop. Okay, so they do just have a bunch of T.Y. Beanie Boos, which I actually used to collect before Squishmallows, and this guy's super cute. A bit weird and super realistic, but cute. And then look at this little Pusheen. Oh my gosh, imagine they made Pusheen Squishmallows. This one basically is. It's so cute. And they also have a dog Pusheen. Oh my gosh. Seriously, Squishmallows, please collab. That would be so cute. But anyways, they don't have any Squishmallows. It would be a fail, but might as well check since I'm at this casino and they have a gift shop. So you never know, like, random gift shops sometimes sell like squish. So I don't usually gamble, but this is so cute. I'm petting him. To end off the night, my grandma and I went across and gambled, and look how pretty the lights are. Oh my gosh, I love it so much. This is Planet Hollywood, by the way, if you guys are wondering. Alright you guys, so as you can see, I am home now, and let's just get straight into the haul and review. I'm super excited, especially because I wanted Easton, and I was disappointed when I had to choose between Easton or the Axolotl when I was in Oregon, and I chose the Axolotl, hoping that they would make him in a smaller size, and they did! Oh my gosh! And the fact that I found him, I was pretty excited. Even though I want to find, like, Cameron, or you know, those guys from Target, I was still really happy that I found the main one I was looking for. Anyways, let's get into it. All right, you guys. 
There they are. Yes, they are in their bags. Look at how smushed these guys are. I was so happy to find these guys. Every time I went to Smith's in Vegas, they were like half off, which was crazy. And then Target, of course, and I also got the mushroom. That's a sneak peek, you guys. I put some squishmallows in there. So let's just get into it real quick. All right, you guys. So starting off with Target, I spent $18.41. I got the mushroom jar for $5. And Easton was $11.99. And I believe he's a 10 inch. I am not certain. I don't know. But I am so excited. Pretty cheap. And I found this mushroom deco jar in the dollar spot. And oh my gosh, you guys. First off, I love green and I love mushrooms and jars, okay? And it was only $5. They also had a brown one and that was super cute. I maybe should have gotten another one. I did not think of the Squishmallow idea until last night. So I picked out the green and kind of neutral and brown color Squishville that I have and displayed them. So I have Juniper in there, the new little wombat that I got, and the platypus. Oh my gosh, they are so cute, you guys. If you guys see this mushroom jar at Target, I definitely recommend putting your Squishville in it because it is so cute. And I just pop it off and you could fit about, about seven. And then I put two in the middle to just keep them straight and in their spots and it works really well. So I love that. If I can find another one, the other color, I'm definitely going to get it and fill it with more Squishville. So the Squishville mushroom was unplanned, but was super cool. But let's get into Easton. I was so excited to find him, and I noticed a lot of them. Like some of them, the eyes are further apart or closer together. And this guy was a little bit more derpy, but I chose him because these spots are going this way, the other one was going that way. And I am very picky. I do look at like the fine details of the print that, this, that these type of squish have, but oh my gosh, I'm so excited that I found him. So I did put him back at Fred Meyer to get this beauty, Jasmine, because he is so beautiful and I've always wanted a big Axo and it's one of my favorite colors. And I was pretty sad because I wanted Easton as well, but I didn't have enough room. I was on a road trip, etc. I wish for a smaller size and they gave me him. He does not have his freaking squad pick, so I have no idea what other ones that they are selling in his squad. I've just seen a few ones on Mercari. He is so cute. Oh my gosh, there's his tail. I'm not usually into the sea squishmallows, but the new ones that they have dropped recently are so funny, like the swordfish, the anglerfish, that, that I have to buy them, you guys. Like, look at his little light bulb. I know that's not what it's called, but it's so cute. And his smile is what sends me. He's like weird cute, and I love weird cute. So... Here is his bio. You guys can pause if you want to read. It says, scared of the dark? Don't worry, he will light your way. That is so cute. So that is little Easton, and I am so, so, so happy I got him because he has been my dream for like two months since I saw him in Oregon. So, yay! And then next up, my haul from Smith's. So this was a different Smith's in Vegas. So these guys were $9.99 each with the sale price so originally as you guys saw the total was $55 because they would be $25 each plus tax of course however they were on sale I saved $15 on each one so they were 20 bucks for both of them $10 for brand new 12 inches so that is super cool so I picked up these two they are so cute this is Bichon I don't know if that's how you are supposed to say it let's see her bio real quick to see if we can find out who she is or who he is apparently doesn't look like it says he has eight tentacles though so maybe he's just like some type of octopus i don't know but he is so cute i love his colors he reminds me of a sun especially with his tentacles they are so funny they also look like a lotus bloom like i don't know super cute though i really am excited to find him because i did get the swordfish at fred meyer from this squad and i didn't want like a bunch from his squad and I finally got them so Bichon is if that's how you say it oh my gosh I am so happy I found him he even has of course the shimmery ears that I can never resist on a squishmallow ever they know me too well look at him I mean his blush ah, I love him so much and this is like attached right here but you can literally like it's pockets you guys hold on could I just I think I 
Um, you guys, they're literally pockets. Hold on. That is so funny. Look at that. That's not even intentional, I don't think, but you can literally just hold a bunch of four inches. You can even do it on the back. That is so funny. He can be a mama to like all of these guys, but okay, let's let's get them out of here. Okay, maybe a bit stretched out, but he's, he's all good. He's good. He is so funny. I love the weirdly cute ones, obviously. Real quick, let's read his bio. You guys can pause. He is a jazz musician. Now let's move on to the jellyfish. Forna, Forna. Yes, I don't know if how to say that specifically. These names are getting a bit difficult to pronounce, okay? One of the very first Squishmallows I ever bought for myself was a jellyfish, and that was about two years ago, and I didn't even film. It was from Walgreens, I believe. And now I finally have another one, and this one is a 12 inch, a little big boy. And so cute. I really love the colors. I can never resist green. That's why I got Jasmine over Easton initially at Fred Meyer because it's green. I've never seen that green before. And then this is very similar. They really complement each other. They're so cute. I just realized, you guys, I got all sea squish in today's video. That's pretty cool. So I'm pretty sure all of the jellyfish have the same like ribbon, colored ribbon. Super cute. I wish they added more for like the bigger ones because they should have more. I mean, that's not, that's not enough, you know? It's a little slim, but anyways, so cute. Love the spots. I couldn't resist. And then, he, okay. Here is her bio. She is an interpretive dance instructor. But these are the two that I got. Two for 20. That was such a great deal. I couldn't pass up. And I know I could have just gotten one for $10 and still gotten the deal. But I really wanted this one as well. Like, I wanted this one. But then I wanted her and I couldn't really decide between them, so I figured two for 20, I'm gonna do it. They're only 10 bucks each. So that is everything that I got in this part of the Las Vegas Squish Hunt. And I'm pretty sure there will be one more part and that will be coming very shortly, so make sure to stay tuned for that. And let me know down below, is this super cute or what? I did not think of using it as like a Squishville display case, cause now I think I should have gotten it like another one or five not really but they're so cute look it all right you guys so i hope you enjoyed part three of the las vegas squish hunt sorry for this video being a little bit late it happens i hope you guys enjoy don't forget to leave a like and comment down below which was your favorite squishmallow we got they were all sea life ones so let me know which one was your favorite i think the anglerfish was mine because you know he was my diso but and his teeth also, I think I was really smart to randomly think to put Squishville in here last night because, oh my gosh, I need to go run to Target before you guys buy them all out because I told you to, so pretty cute. Don't forget to subscribe for more content like this as well as the next part, which will most likely be the last. It will be days four and five because I cut out a couple clips and you guys will see what clips I cut out of this part to put into the next part. So anyways, I will see you guys in the next video, which will most likely be the new five below drop because I ordered them online and they should be arriving tomorrow. So yes, I love you guys so much. Bye. <laughs>